The next bag that Cashew is presenting for us today is this small cinch bucket in dune leather. Thanks, bud. So this is the very last large piece of dune leather. So this is the last bag that will be available in this leather. Um, I only have small pieces for journal covers and wallets and stuff. Um, but this bag, I did think about keeping it, but as I've said before, I can't keep all the bags. Um, but this one does have a little bit of a blemish going on. So what happened with this bag is for the first time, I decided to put um, my tag on the inside using rivets. And I do like this method. I have some smaller rivets coming that I will use and do this going forward. However, I hadn't had enough coffee in the morning when I did this and <clears throat> so mad at myself. I put the rivets through the lining and then after it was on, I went to open this pocket and it was attached to the lining. <sighs> Not a good moment. I was like, I need more coffee. So what I did is I un I took out the rivets and I had to sew a patch to cover the holes that I had put in this lining. So it's not a huge blemish. It still looks incredible. It's not going to affect the function of this bag, obviously, but just know there is a patch back here on the lining sewn on to cover those holes. However, this bag is so pretty. Um, the dune leather has a little bit of a sheen to it, but it's mostly matte. It is super drapey and super light. Um, but so far it seems like it is incredibly durable. Any little scratch it gets just rubs right out. And of course it is a gorgeous saddle tan color. Um, this hide in particular, or this piece of the hide had really, really amazing neck rolls here on the pocket. And then on the back of the bag as well, had some really amazing neck rolls. So, and wrinkles. So the character on this hide is really amazing. And that's something that makes full grain leathers really stand out is having those characteristics still showing because you have that top grain of the leather intact. And as you can see, this bag has a really gorgeous um, orange marigold lining. And again, this is the small size. And this strap does not belong to this bag. It needs its own strap, but this is what it looks like on the body.